I mentioned earlier that here in New York City, the weather has been kind of strange, although we're, we're well into spring. We're, it is spring, isn't it? Like, yeah, March 23rd, I guess, was spring. And uh, we thought we'd visit with some New Yorkers on the streets of Manhattan tonight and give you folks across the country a feel for what springtime is like here in the city. Hal, can we take a look at the camera downstairs? This is uh, on 6th Avenue. There's Radio City just next door to us. We're looking north toward Central Park. And as you can see, it's uh, light and spring light as far as spring like as far as the uh, sun goes in the sky, but it's drizzling and sort of uh, chilly. There's a bus, people going home from work, but it's, it's much lighter than you would expect for this kind of weather. People can actually hear me, can't they? And Eric is our cameraman. Eric, can you hear me? Okay, Eric can hear e Either that or he's being mugged. All right, Eric, go over to this gentleman here in the uh, trench coat and the hat, this man right there. Excuse me, sir. Sir, pardon me, can you hear me? How do you do? What, what is your name, sir? Dwayne Rice. Dwayne, where are you from? Brooklyn. What do you do for a living, Dwayne? Security. Y in security? Yes. Are you on your way home from work? Yes, I am. Uh -huh. Are you enjoying the spring weather here in New York? Wait. If this is spring. <laughs> <laughs> what, what are you going to do tonight, Dwayne? Go home and look at some TV. What, what will you be watching tonight? What's on your Wednesday schedule? Dynasty. And then, and then, uh, like after the late news, what will we be uh, watching then, Dwayne? Well, I'll look Dwight? at Homebox then. <laughs> You're doing the what? Homebox. 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 HBO. Okay. Hey, was it Dwayne or Dwight? I'm sorry. Dwayne. Dwayne, nice meeting you. Have a pleasant evening. Thanks for stopping by. Thank you. Okay, take care. That was Dwayne. All right, gentlemen, nice to see you. How do you do? And, uh, oh, let, let me talk to the, uh, uh, the guy looks like me. Let me talk to this woman back there. The one on the, uh, no, in the, in the rain bonnet, right behind the woman waving. Yeah. Come here, man. <laughs> How do you do, ma'am? <laughs> yes, it's a magic moment in her life. Ma'am, can, can you, uh, lady, can I see some identification, please? Did you steal that rain bonnet, lady? What? <laughs> what, what is your name, ma'am? Hello, I, this is Dave Letterman. What is your name, ma'am? Melba. Oh, Melba. Uh, where are you from, Melba? Can you hear me, Melba? Oklahoma. She's from Oklahoma. Are you Are you visiting New York? No, no. Are you here on a visit? It's a very strange ventriloquist act going on down. All right, Melba, thank you very much. Have a nice stay in Oklahoma. Nice meeting you. Oh, my goodness. She's stunned beyond belief, isn't she? Let me, uh, let's see who else we have out there. Uh, uh, that guy right there. Get this man right there in the hat. Can we? Hey, you. Hey, buddy. Hey. Somebody stole my briefcase. Okay, he's going out. Can we get the guy in the umbrella? How do you do, ma'am? Nice to see you. There, there's... <laughs> there's nothing more to be seen here, ma'am. Go back to your home. This guy right there. Can we get the gentleman in the leather jacket? I guess we can't. Turn around the other way and... Uh, uh, okay, let's see. We're looking for... This guy in this... Right there. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Hi. How are you? What is your name, sir? Excuse me, sir. What is your name? They can't hear us. They can't hear us? He can't hear, he can't hear David. The speaker's gone. So we, we have someone, uh, uh, a helpful citizen Greg on the Hicks. street interpreting for us? Where are you from? I'm from uh, Marin County in California. Marin County in California. What are you doing here? He can't hear me I'm, at all, I guess. Uh, so I might, I might as well go home and, and let the guy on the so street do the show. See, uh, uh, well, what, what should we do? Peters he can't hear me at all. How did you, you like her? her? It was great. Well, this is, now, I've lost She's complete control. The guy... The guy on the street is doing an interview with their hold. They even have things to hold up down there. No point for me to be here. Did you see this thing? We got one of these. Sweet charity. After that. I tell you what, can we see about getting the sound back or is it just going? It's those damn Libyans. They've been tampering with our sound. We'll do a commercial and we'll try and get the sound back. We're not done here. Don't worry. We'll be right back. Now. I understand we have the uh, audio working downstairs. Let's go back down and we'll finish this up for you. And I forget the gentleman's name. Is he still there, the guy we were speaking with earlier from Marin County? Where, where is he now? Yeah, that's him. 
Is, is he gone? He's gone. Okay, well, how about this man? Excuse me, sir, can you hear me? The man that looks like D'Artagnan there. No, no, we don't. What? Why, is that? Oh, how do you do? Hi. What, what is your name, sir? My name's Greg Hicks. Greg, nice to have you here. You know, Craig, what we wanted to do... It's Greg. Uh, I'm sorry, Greg. That's all right, David. Don't, don't push your luck. Oh, okay. Um, we, we, we would like... To, are you visiting New York City? Yes, for one day only. Well, well, this is your lucky day because we're going to buy you a new suit of clothing. <laughs> Oh, now, are you, know. you are you near Bancroft? Uh, <laughs> is it Greg or Craig? It's Greg. Greg. Thanks, Dave. Okay. Are you near Bancroft? I don't know. Am I? I'm Turn to your left and see if there's a store there named Bancroft. Oh yeah, it's right oh, here. Brother. Oh my gosh. Has no idea. He's four feet from an eight foot sign. He has no idea. All right. I'll go on in the store there. We'll buy a complete set of clothing. Oh, okay. Go on in. Do you have some time for this? Oh yes, I do. I'm in a C Sweet Charity tonight though, so I don't know. Okay. Go on in there. <laughs> uh, and uh, there should be a gentleman in there. Is there anybody in the store? Is there a guy named Herman there? Herman, are you around? Herman, Herman this is Craig or Greg from California. My pleasure. Uh, we want to buy him a suit, maybe a, a pair of slacks and a sport jacket. I'd like a suit. <laughs> Uh, apparently we're having audio difficulties again because... All right, I'll tell you what, we have our wardrobe supervisor, Eric Anthony. Come on in, Eric, and let's pick this man out a suit or something for springtime, and uh, we'll help him... Uh... Hi, Hi, Eric. Nice to see you. Now, this, uh, we got a guy down here from Northern California. Instead of a uh, sport coat and a pair of slacks, he wants a suit. What, what could you suggest for him and Herman to pick out tonight? Well, he's from uh, California. California, Northern California, Marin well, County. let's make it light. Well, he's, <laughs> he's, wearing a, he's wearing a sweatshirt and a, uh, and a tie. It's a start. Yeah. <laughs> uh, California, I'd say, how about a nice light blue suit? Light or? blue suit. Herman, do you have one of those for us? Summer uh, light blue suit. Light, uh, light blue. Light, light blue? Light, light blue. blue. Yeah. Well, <laughs> you, I tell you what, Herman, go out and pick out a okay. light blue suit. Okay. And, uh, and, and, a, and a tie? What kind of tie, Eric? I'd say a bright tie. What kind of shirt? Let's say a madras shirt. Yeah, not a dull tie like he's wearing. No, we no, don't no, no striped ties. No striped ties. The guy's dressed like a target. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'd say it's a striped shirt. A, stri a striped a shirt? Bright, Stripe on oh. the shirt or a madras shirt. Okay, I'll tell you what, you a guys get started on that. Uh, okay. Get the suit, get the tie, get the shirt, and so forth, and we'll check back with you a little bit later, okay? Great. Okay. <laughs> this is going nowhere fast. Okay, Eric, Thank thanks you. for your help. We have to move on here. Thank you. Uh, this is hopeless. Well... <laughs> Pretty good. Not a bad, uh, not a bad looking suit. It's about a size 60. We'll have to take that in. That was uh, Greg Hicks from Marin County, California. We're buying him a new suit for springtime, and uh, let's. Uh, we'll be checking back with those folks later. Regulator guys taking a cab. All right, we're down there at the uh, Bancroft Clothing Store, and uh, that gentleman is uh, Greg Hicks. He's picking out a new suit. That's Herman, the proprietor. They're looking at uh, shirts. Looks like a good fit on that suit. And, uh... Hi, David. Hi, how you doing? Good. What kind of material is that, Greg? This is, um... No, the suit. Oh. I don't know, but you know what? I just noticed it was marked down. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a hot price, David. Oh, uh, why don't you get on a plane like... and go back to California? <laughs> Uh, all right, well, go ahead and uh, finish up the wardrobe there, and we'd like to see you in it at the end of the show if you have time. Okay, Greg? Uh, that's great. Okay. Thanks again. Gee, I hope the wine isn't chilled improperly. <laughs> I'll let you know. Okay, thanks, Greg. Hotel accommodations for most guests of Late Night with David Letterman furnished by the Berkshire Place and Omni Classic Hotel in exchange for this announcement. For reservations at Omni Hotels in the U.S. and Europe, call toll-free 800-THE-OMNI. This is uh, Greg Hicks. Greg, stand up. Stand up and uh, show the folks what you got. Turn around there. Put on, put on the hat. See the hat? Oh, the hat. Yeah. Right. Very nice. Oh, you know, I've always wanted to do this. <laughs> 
Uh, what, do, what do you do for a living, Greg, back there uh, in Marin County? I'm a uh, human resources manager in San Francisco for a large insurance company. Uh huh. And uh, so you could probably, an extra suit would come in handy, wouldn't it? it it's perfect, yeah. actually. We're, yeah. Now, they're going to do all of the alterations for you? All free. And what was the total on this? Because we're going to take see. care of it for you. Are you, know? you it was 30743. 307, but some of this yeah. is marked down, wasn't it? Yeah, this was marked. The suit itself okay. was marked down. Well, thanks for playing along. I hope well, you enjoy the suit. One more thing. I've always oh, wanted brother. to. You've been a pain in the <laughs> all night. What is it? I've always wanted to do this in national TV. Uh oh, wait a minute. Hal, Hal, hold it. Get ready in the control room. Okay. Tonight, tonight, <laughs> we'll be just any night. Tonight, there will be. Greg, have a good trip back to uh, San Francisco. Wow. Let me. Uh, I'll tell you what, we have some grapes here for you, Greg. Let me, uh, let me uh, explain something. Lincoln Burnham, the gentleman from New Hampshire who was going to be with us tonight, I'm awfully sorry we ran out of time. But but since he doesn't use clocks, he doesn't know it. But. He'll be back as soon as possible. Tomorrow night, Jonathan Winters, Judy Mowate, and uh, viewer mail. Have a nice night. Thanks again, folks. Bye-bye.